In this video, I'm going to be sharing eight pregnancy announcement niche ideas that you could be designing for right now. So let's just get right into it. Number one is holidays. Again, what better way to announce that you're pregnant than during a holiday? And if you're thinking like major holidays, like of course, Valentine's is coming up, St. Patrick, uh, Christmas, Halloween, think about smaller ones events awareness pretty much get you a calendar list all the major holidays if you don't know go and google them but think about all the different types of like events that happen throughout the year or awareness that happen throughout the year that somebody might want to use that to announce that they're pregnant the second one is a funny pregnancy announcement guys if you're not clever or if you're like i don't even know how to be funny you can go on Google and search like funny pregnancy announcement ideas, sayings, puns, anything like that will be helpful. Also, you can go on Etsy. You can go on other like retailers and just search for how people are announcing that they're pregnant. Sometimes even Pinterest, if you go and search pregnancy announcements, Pinterest has so many clever ideas. And for some reason, funny sayings do really well when it comes to announcing that you're pregnant. The third idea is making it specific to like a family member. Meaning like if you're trying to tell your mom that you're pregnant or your grandma or your aunt or your husband. So target that specific person. Or if you're trying to tell, you know, a brother or that's going to be a big brother or your daughter that's going to be a big sister. You can target those specific type of people too when you're creating pregnancy announcements. The fourth idea is first time moms. So a mom that's expecting for the first time is super excited. She's having a first baby. This could be a very specific way to target the audience that's looking for an announcement that's not just saying like, oh, I'm going to be a parent or whatever, you know, you want to spin it on. But it's specifically talking to the ones that are becoming parents for the very first time. The fifth niche idea is targeting a hobby or like an activity. So for example, if camping, you can do like adventure ways or expecting our future little camper or if you love sports like football, tailgating for two. So target specific hobbies, specific activities, things that people like. If you again don't know where to begin with this, go on Etsy, go on Google and search what are like top hobbies, top you know, activities that people like to do and seeing how you can get clever by matching, you know, a certain activity, like let's say hiking and announcing that you're pregnant or skiing and announcing that you're pregnant. So all these different, you know, hobbies and activities, seeing how you can match them with announcing that you're pregnant. Idea number six is multiples. I'm a twin mom. It's a lot different expecting one, you know, long, two, three, four babies at a time. So this could be a really specific way to target the mom to be that's suspecting multiples so you can get really clever with this one there's so many like twin pawns and sayings and phrases that you can come up with to target the expecting mom of multiples number seven is food and hear me out you're probably thinking like how does food goes with being pregnant again when you're pregnant food plays a big role i mean sometimes at the beginning it might be a little sick but it does play a big role you can use Food items like cookies, eating cookies for two, eating ice cream for two, donuts for two. So there's so many clever ways that you can incorporate a food item with a pregnancy announcement. So just get clever and see what things you can come up with. Number eight is targeting the different seasons. But I mean seasons, I mean like summer, fall, spring, winter. So you can say, you know, sun's out, bum's out summer and bumping or fall leaves and bumps. I mean, these are just ideas that I just came up with in my head, but people love the different seasons and what better way to announce that you're pregnant than with like a pregnancy announcement season type. If you're gonna get inspiration from this list, I will start with maybe two, max three ideas because you really want to go really hard and really deep into those two to three niches, you don't want to be all over the place. So please don't go and target all of these different types of ideas because then you're going to end up nowhere and you're going to wonder why you're not making any sales because you really need to truly learn what these people like, what they don't like, fonts, colors, patterns, everything in between. So really pick two to three and run with those and make the best out of those two to three ones that you decide to go with really create so many different types of designs because just because I'm announcing that I'm pregnant during the summer 
that means that you and I would like the same type of designs. Everybody likes different things, even when they're in the same niche. So just go and focus on two to three max and really create so many different types of designs variation that this target audience will like. And guys, if you're looking for more niche ideas, then I'm going to be linking this video next because on that video, I talk about a very specific niche, which is the occupational niche. And I give you so many different types of niches of some niches that you could be designing for in that niche. See you on the next one.